welcome you to South Africa and we thank you so much for joining us. I'd like to introduce to you Prof Barry and Prof Anderson, a little bit older professor than you. <laughs> Europe and most had uh, really been at fault for dividing the co continent and the, uh, well, uh, you know, the European scramble for Africa. So I feel like uh, the first world and third world have not had good relations. And even with our consciousness nowadays, things still haven't gotten that much better. I'm not sure, Dr. Zane, that's what you want to hear. <laughs> so, so let's... I'm an eternal hope. So I would think, and I would disagree with you probably to a degree, and allow me to lead you on this discourse, that I think that our minds are so influenced by, by things that are external to us, that I think that the more we become conscious of who we are as people, the more that we become conscious as what humanity is about, I think it will allow us to be able to work together more closely. And I think that the African continent is now becoming more educated. Um, you have a, an African continent from the past where people were uh, very much rural, people were not allowed access to education. That has changed significantly. So I think with this more um, people becoming conscious in their small geopolitical environments, that that might change. But I'll talk to you in about 20 years. Okay. <laughs>